All right, I'm going to be talking about the major landmarks of the central auditory system. Here I've gone ahead and drawn a picture of the auditory cortex. Um, down here we have a cochlea and a cochlea, and here is the cochlear nucleus. So that is the first brainstem synapse. It receives same side ear information that is organized by frequency. From here we'll move over to the superior olivary complex. At the superior olivary complex, um, it's the area where information from both ears converges and it's responsible for assessing a sound based on its intensity and the timing differences. Um, from there, we'll, we travel via the lateral lemniscus up to the inferior colliculi. Um, at the inferior colliculus, uh, it receives monural as well as binaural information, and it primarily functions for sound localization. Um, from there, we arrive at the medial geniculate, um, and the medial geniculate, it basically relays information from the inferior colliculus up to the auditory cortex. At the auditory cortex, that is where we are able to comprehend spoken language.